What's happening YouTube? Geeky Guy Comics here from the Killer Comic Show. Now this week we have 15 top comic releases that we have put together to show you what you can pick up in your LCS or online this Wednesday week number five for new comic book day. Myself, Andy, Tom and Pete have picked 15 comics. It's going to be an absolute banger. So without further ado, sit back, have your coffee and have a look what we've chosen for you this week. Right up first from Image Comics, we have Moon Man issue number one. Main cover by Michael Bichetti. Cover B, which is the Eric de Urso variant cover. Cover C, which is by Rod Rees. And we have a cover D, which is the 1 in 20 Sanford Green variant cover. I think we can all agree that these are absolutely sensational. We've got another seven coming up for you now, so let's have a look. We've got cover E, which is the 1 in 25 Christian Wall variant. Cover F, which is the 1 in 50 Matt Taylor. We have the cover G, which is the 1 in 100 Bill Sinkovic variant cover and we have the Ivan Teo Rabbit Comics exclusive variant cover I think mine has to be the 1 in 50 favourite to be fair and to finish it off we have the Nuno Pereira Stadium Comics homage and we have the T4 Ryan G Brown Virgin variant cover there and Matt Wilson with the Megacom exclusive variant cover to finish off Moon Man issue number one Over to Dynamite now for Lilo and Stitch. For you Disney lovers out there, we have another 10 covers. We've got the main cover by Joshua Middleton. We have cover B, which is the David Nakayama variant cover. Cover C, which is the Jennifer Meyer variant. And cover D, which is the Craig Rousseau color bleed variant cover. But that's not all. We have more. We have the 616 Comics Unknown Comic Books Sabine Rich variant cover. We have the Comic Exposure Ron Leary Jr. variant. We have the mbartis.com James C. Mulligan variant cover. And we have the Rabbit Comics Hugh Ding Negative Space Virgin variant. Eight covers so far. We've got one more to go. And that is a Megacon Orlando 2024 Tanya Leroux Virgin variant cover there. I think I pronounced her name right. Tanya Lehu. Tanya Lehu Virgin variant cover for all you Lilo and Stitch Disney lovers out there. I know this is going to be one for the favourites for the kids. So make sure you pick it up. Over to Marvel now for Dead X-Men issue number one. We have the main cover by Pepe Perez. We've got the Kevin Eastman Wolverine, Wolverine, Wolverine variant. We have the Lucas Vernick variant cover. And we have a 1 in 25 Leslie LaRue Lee variant cover there. We have Philadelphia issue number 33 back over at Image Comics now. We've got the main cover by Jason Sean Alexander. Cover B, which is also by Jason Sean Alexander. And then cover C, we have a black and white Noor Jason Sean Alexander variant cover. Over to Comics Experience Publishing, a new one that we've never featured on the show before. This is Tuscan's issue number one. We have the main cover by Daniel Gover. We have cover B, which is also by Daniel Gover. And we have cover C, which is the Yuko Smith variant cover there. Don't know much about this, but Andy's picked this one, so hopefully it's a good one. Over to Marvel now for Avengers Twilight issue number two. We have the main cover by Ross and Acuna. We've got the Daniel Acuna variant cover. We have the Greg Smallwood variant cover. And we have the Phil Noto Lightning Bolt trade variant cover there as well. This looks pretty good. But we have three more covers as well. We've got the 1 in 25 Sergio de Villa variant cover. We have the 1 in 50 Superlog variant. And then we have the 1 in 200 Virgin Lightning Bolt variant from the one and only Phil Noto. Staying on the Avengers theme now, we have Avengers Inc. issue number five. We have the main cover by Daniel Kuna. We have the Visions Marvel Masterpiece three variant cover. And we have the Todd Nook Wolverine, Wolverine, Wolverine variant as well. Quite a few of them out. Over to Ribbon Queen issue number seven. This has been all kinds of awesome messed upness. This is the main cover by Declan Shelby. We have cover B by Cully Hamner. And we have cover C, which is the Jane Burroughs horror poster homage. AWA putting out some absolute fire. So if you can pick this up and enjoy it. Over to 
Mad Cave Comics again. Now, this is The Devil That Wears My Face, issue number four. This has been absolutely incredible. Loving this, loving all the devil worshipping and everything going on. And this is the main cover by a friend of Peter, Triple G. This is Alex Cormack. Swiftly over to one of our favourites now. This is Skybound with Duke issue number two. We have the main cover by Tom Riley. We have cover B, which is the Ricardo Lopez Ortiz variant cover. We have the cover C, which is the 1 in 10 Tyler Boss variant. And my favourite is the cover D, which is the 1 in 25 Akko variant cover. Duke is the addition. It's kicking on. It's more and more to go with the energy on universe. So make sure you pick this up, enjoy it and read it. We've got DC now with DC Trinity Special Issue Number 1. We have the main cover by Daniel Semper. We've got cover B, which is the Jules Jimenez variant cover. That's my favourite. Cover C, which is the Belen Ortega variant cover. And then we have cover D, which is the 1 in 25 Mitch Gerrard's variant. Moving over to Distillery Comics now, we have gone issue number two. The first issue was absolute fire, so I'm sure this is going to be much of the same. Main cover by Jock, cover B by Jock, cover C is the one in 10 by Lee Garbutt. Then we have cover D, which is the one in 25 Oliver Barrett variant cover. And we have cover E, the one in 50 by Matt Taylor. And to finish it off, we have cover F, which is the Jamie McAlvey variant cover. Staying on Distillery now, we have Somna issue number two. Absolutely love the first one. Tula Latte and Becky Clooney are absolutely smashing the boy out of the park with this one. This is issue number two. Main cover by Tula Latte. Cover B is by Becky Clunan. Cover C is the 1 in 10 Emily Carroll variant cover. The D, which is the 1 in 25 Julian Totino Tedesco variant cover. Cover E is the 1 in 50 by the very, very talented Danny. And to finish it off, we have a cover G, which is the Tula Latte. Not safe for work, Polly bag variant cover. Back over to Mad K Comics now for one of my favourites this year. It's Chard Remains issue number two. This is the main cover by the very talented Andrea Muti. And to finish off our top 15 picks for week number five, we have Power Rangers Unlimited from Boom Studios. We have the main cover by Tony Infante, cover B by Goni Mentes, cover C by Tony Infante, and cover D by Mikel Mercado. Right, so there we have it. There's 15 top banging comics there for you to get your teeth into this week. If there are ones that we haven't picked and you think we should be in the know, drop a comment down below of this video and we can pick it up, we can have a look and maybe we can review it live every single Thursday on the Killer Comic Show. You know the place to be. It's standard now. It's five years old, that show. So a massive shout out to all the people that have already subscribed and tune in every single week. Not only that, this year we have now started this video that goes live every single Monday at 12 p.m. And we also have the Thank Fuck It's Wednesday on a live 8pm stream, only place to be on our YouTube channel. That is that. And then we have the additional show on a Thursday as well. Guys, it's fantastic. We do this week in, week out just to give you the comic knowledge and help give you the comic information on comics that you might have missed or not picked up yet. Always a pleasure seeing you in the stream and also for receiving your comments on the video. So as always, have a fantastic week. Enjoy what you're reading, enjoy what you're picking up, and we shall see you on Thursday and also on Wednesday at the Killer Comic Show and Thank Fuck It's Wednesday. Have a good one, people, and I'll see you soon.